Hey, my name is Yuri, and today I'm going to be reviewing the Aqua X Sport shoe from Zero Shoe. This is a new upcoming shoe. I'm going to read the specs really quick. This is a water friendly sport shoe. The upper material is a water friendly mesh. The insole is a three millimeter athletic Eva foam insole. I usually take these out, but it does come with these. Uh, lining material is quick drying. This is a vegan shoe, so no animal products are used on it. And the outsole height and lugs, we have lugged feel true soles with 3.5 millimeter lugs. The total stack height is 11 millimeters and the men's weight is 7.2 ounces per shoe. The women's weight is 5.6 ounces per shoe. So um, that's the technical specs. And here's what the shoe looks like. So it, it's an athletic shoe. It's got an undersole with these uh, aggressive kind of treads. Standard zero shoes fashion. The sole is flexible. The sole is flat. As I mentioned, I Typically, I have wider feet and I like the better ground feel. So when I get a new pair of zero shoes, they come with the insoles. I take out the insoles. That's up to you whether you want to keep them or not. I like the extra room in the shoe. Uh, the upper is very thin, so you can pretty much see my hand through it. The idea is that it's going to be quick drying and this is a very good warm weather shoe because of the thin upper it wouldn't be a very viable as a cold weather shoe. These elastic laces come with the shoe. So one thing I typically do when I get a new pair of shoes is I take out the regular laces and I put in elastic laces because I think they're superior in pretty much every way. And that is a very cool feature of the Aqua X is that it already comes with the elastic laces installed. Uh, fits pretty well. I wear a size 10 Prio and I find without the insoles these are a little bit more roomy than that. This is what I love about the elastic laces. You go like this, boom, done. The shoe is on your foot and you can adjust it but very easy to take on and off. You don't have to waste time tying your shoe. You don't have to worry about your shoe getting untied. So very easy, very simple. I'm wearing socks right now. And you can see I have a, you can't see, I have a little bit of extra room in the toes. But it's overall very comfortable. If I was barefoot, I find these shoes to be a little bit roomy, but with socks, I find they fit really well. You can see the flexibility of the shoe, how I can move it around and it conforms to the shape of my foot. So that is very important in any shoe. As I mentioned in my previous reviews, the shoe should allow you to walk naturally, to walk similar to how you, Ideally, it should let you walk identical, but there's still a layer of rubber in between you and the floor. So at least you should be walking as close as possible as you would barefoot. And these shoes definitely allow that. The tread on the bottom, it's pretty thick. It's pretty aggressive. So I find if I'm on concrete, for example, the tread is not as comfortable, but it's really good for, uh, for grass or different kind of terrain if you're going hiking. It's winter right now, so I haven't gone hiking with these, but I will once it gets a little bit warmer. But in that sense, if you do use them as kind of a training athletic shoe on soft surfaces, it will probably get more comfortable after these guys wear down a bit because they do protrude quite a bit. And I think that's something that's more conducive towards either softer terrain or uneven terrain but other than that I mean there's not too much else to say about these shoes that are super comfortable that they dry fast is really nice I know I was hiking in my Prios in um, in the mountains of Kerry, Ireland and I came across some wet spots and some bogs and my Prios basically completely soaked through to the point that I was carrying them and just walking barefoot. So a shoe like this 
would have been more friendly in that terrain. But it's, yeah, it's just having the right tool for the right job. So this just gives you another option. And of course, with how light they are, with how well they breathe, definitely very good as a general athletic training shoe or just even a, a random walking around shoe because of the comfort and convenience of the pre-installed elastic laces. Really easy to just uh, you know, slip these guys on, go to the store, and because they are that versatile, very easy to run in. I was doing sprints in the park with these the other day, felt great. Uh, I was on the grass and uh, had a really nice grip on the grass with these shoes. So yeah, really good. The color scheme, this isn't a negative. It's just the color scheme is bright for me because I like all black shoes, but um, if you like bright colors, it's nice. I was told by someone that the color is good because it matches my eyes. I don't know. Uh, that's something I didn't think about. I typically prefer to get the shoes that are all black because that's just my style. So I'm not as much of a fan of the bright colors, but that's not a negative of the shoe. That's just personal style. Um, other negative that I can think of, it's the right tool for the job, right? So they're very thin. So obviously you're not gonna be using these shoes in cold weather unless you got some really heavy socks underneath. Um, but other than that, yeah, it's, it's another great option from Zero Shoes, another versatile shoe that's intended as a water-friendly sports shoe, but you can use it as a casual shoe, you can use it as an athletic training shoe, you can use it as, um, as, as pretty much anything involving warm weather and or water. So yeah, that is the uh, Aqua X Sport. And in the spirit of transparency, because it is important to note, uh, I was given these shoes for free in exchange for a review. And I do have an affiliation with Zero Shoes where if you click on my affiliate link and you buy from there, I do get a portion of those uh, proceeds. I do get a commission. So just to be transparent with where this review is coming from. That being said, I love Zero Shoes. I own many different pairs. I think in terms of barefoot shoes, this is one of the best companies on the market to go for. And they're constantly expanding their inventory for uh, different options so you can have these different barefoot shoes in these different styles and it's uh i think shoes are very important and i think barefoot walking mechanics are very important for general health so you want to have a shoe that allows for that to happen and the zero shoes aqua x sport is absolutely a great option for that